I can't edit this because I lost the YouTube blah, 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 editing thing. Anyway, here I am. Look, the drums, they're facing a different direction. So, uh, hang on. What the zero say to the eight? Nice belt. All right, here we go. It's out. All right, this is the last plug for the drum clinic. Yes, I'm doing a Bonzolium drum clinic. Saturday, this coming Saturday. Today is Monday, October 23rd, 2017. This coming Saturday is October 28th, 2017. At 3 o'clock, from 3 p.m. to 5 p.m., I'm doing a drum clinic at Drums Etc. in Lancaster, that's the Chicago pronunciation. Lancaster, Pennsylvania. Apparently they say Lancaster or Lancaster, maybe. But it's not that far, I think, from New York. Maybe an hour or two out of New York, I forget. But it's more on the east side of Pennsylvania. So I'll be driving there. I'm leaving Friday and I will be driving cross country to this drum clinic where we will just talk about Zeppelin and Bonham and all kinds of stuff. And there'll be an Amber Vista like kit there that I'm going to play the shit out of. And, uh, I'm bringing this snare drum to raffle it off. This is my blue crolite. Again, I don't know if I told George Flutus that I'm doing this. He might have nine blue babies. Oh, there's a little snare wire missing off it. Or that's, I'll, I'll just clip that off. It's, it still sounds good anyway. So remember, this is just a superphonic, a 70s superphonic, probably from about 70, according to the serial number, maybe about 75, that I'm sure was pitted to hell and somebody just... Um, painted a blue sparkle but it just really has the mojo I don't know if you'll hear it too well here with the microphone here but hang on a second it's my baby and it does have an Evans hydraulic on it a black Evans hydraulic which is pretty much I've looked it up more or less it's pretty much a uh, a Ludwig a Remo vintage emperor okay remember the original emperors back in the day that Bonham used to use were two ply I think they were two five ply maybe two five mil or whatever anyway so it's pretty much has a vintage jumper on it remember you need a thicker head for the bottom sound and a rim shot okay so this is again the final video let's see what kind of sound we get facing the other way remember the magic the magic location now this is a little closer this is a slightly different location than i prefer but we'll do it this way anyway Mm. All right, so this one's literally now just right above. So let me know how you think this one sounds, okay? Normally I like it here, okay, right here. So if I had a drumstick in my right hand over my right handed kit and I went like this, I'd hit the microphone. Bam! But that's the A sweet spot. All right, let's see what we got. So that's, so that's it, okay? Uh, that's the video. My camera's about to run out of juice, so hopefully I will see you this Saturday, October 28th in Lancaster, Pennsylvania at 3 o'clock at Drums Etc. in Lancaster, Pennsylvania. Thank you.